What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Mike Dolce Show. Today, we are tackling fat loss. And really, I'm going to eliminate the mental issue you've had in really activating your fat loss lifestyle. Let's face it, we've done the research. The average person watching this right now needs to lose between 20 and 60 pounds to achieve the body you actually want to achieve. And I'm going to help you get there in this very video with my favorite food hacks. Now, before we get into the meat of the video, pardon the pun, as you'll see later, before we get into the meat of this video, I'm going to give you a free download. It is a free resource. My top five favorite fat loss dinners nobody will ever suspect you are on a diet that's right my favorite dinners nobody will believe you're on a diet they're going to be like how do you look so good how are you so lean what is happening with you share the secrets and you're going to be like i just eat these foods every day they're going to be like you're a liar you can't eat those five amazing delicious meals every single week and look as good as you look and you're going to be like hey what do you want me to tell you? And they're going to say, you're a liar. They're going to leave. They're going to go to Chipotle. They're going to go to Subway. They're going to go to Panera Bread. They're going to go and pretend like they're healthy, kind of like you do. And they're not going to see their body change at all. So free download at the end of the video. But now let's jump in right here. What is the biggest issue? The biggest issue holding you back is the misconception. It is the misconception you have with food because your mommy told you, your daddy told you, your grandma told you, your teacher in school told you, the cafeteria lady, all your friends, your girlfriends, your boyfriends, your husband, your wife, all told you the same lie. Well, here I am, one of the most successful, one of the most accoladed, one of the most jacked and stacked fitness professionals you've ever had the pleasure of meeting, and I'm gonna open my playbook for free. Your mind is the problem. Your flawed, twisted relationship with food is the problem. See, you believe following a healthy eating plan means no more fun food. When I can't eat any more fun food. I just can't follow a strict diet. I can't follow a rigid diet. I need flexibility in my meal plan. I need the ability to eat what I want when I want. And I still want to lose weight. Well, how's that working out for you? Not very good, right? Look down. Strip off your clothes privately. Stare in a full length mirror. And you tell me, how's that working out for you? If you are not jacked and stacked, sculpted and toned, lean and muscular, well, you're wrong. Listen to me, please. Let me help you here. The appearance of food freedom is the problem. You believe you need to eat freely. You believe you need the, the ability to choose whatever you want. When in fact, surge, survey says wrong, eh, big X. Now think about this for a minute. I guarantee you every single day for the last month, but most likely the last year, you've eaten the same one of two breakfasts, the same one of two lunches, and the same one of three dinners. Almost every single day, day after week, after month, after season, after year, with little fluctuation. And when you do eventually bring something slightly different into the foray, that then becomes a regular meal. Now, when you go to a restaurant, stick with me here. Just let me, let me tear down your misconceptions before I give you the holy grail. The, I'm going to give you the secret right now. When you go to a restaurant, you typically go to the same restaurant. Why is this? Because it's comfortable. You know what to expect. You know what you like. Okay, fine. You go to the same basic restaurant. You go to the same breakfast spot. You go to the same lunch spot. You go to the same dinner spot. You go to the same coffee spot. Why is that? Because it's predictable. It's comfortable. You know what you like. Okay, fine. 
when you go to the same breakfast spot, the same lunch spot, the same dinner spot, the same coffee spot, what do you order? Do you look at the board and go, hmm, what am I going to get today out of all these options? Because I want freedom. I don't want to have to eat the same thing every meal every day. I don't want to have to drink the same beverage every drink every day. What do you do? You walk into the coffee shop, you order the same damn thing every single time you walk in. When you walk in the door, the barista starts making your drink. Now, maybe you have a fall drink, a winter drink, a spring drink, a summer drink. Maybe you have a slight little change up, slight little change up every so rarely. When you go to your favorite restaurant for dinner, what do you get? You get the same damn thing. You get the same appetizers. You get the same entrees. And maybe you, oh, maybe I'll get this. Maybe I'll get that. Maybe I'll get this. Maybe I'll get that. Maybe I'll get that. You sit there. You're like, I'll just get the same damn thing I always get because I know what it is. I know what I like. And that's it. So it is the appearance of food freedom that's holding you back. When a world-class, world-class, world title holding multiple weight management coach shares the secrets with you, how dare you not listen? How dare you instead listen to your brother Jed? How dare you listen to good old Bertha in accounting who's following the newest, quickest, fastest BS fad diet that didn't work? Do you want to look like Bertha? Do you want to look like Jed? Or do you want to be 206 pounds at 6% body fat at 47 years old like your friendly Uncle Mike does? I don't know, the, the same guy who's built the greatest bodies in the history of combat sports, the only coach with a 100% success ratio, right? You won't listen to me when I show you how simple it is. You're going to listen to all these other fools. It is the appearance of food freedom that holds you back. And there's an inherent laziness that you need to identify and eradicate. And I'm going to help you with my five top dinner free resource. I'm going to give you my top five easy, delicious dinners for free right now. All you have to do, click the link below this video. Click the link below the video. It'll take you to the blog page. This whole topic is really in the blog. So you can read it if you want to, to reinforce what I just said. You can watch the video again if you want there. You can share it to your friends, please do. Or you just click that little free download link right under the video. And I will literally send you my top five favorite dinners to lose fat, feel amazing, but nobody will know you're on a diet. I'm giving you five meal options. Pick one, pick two, pick three, pick all five. Eat them all the time. Do me a favor. Do me a favor. For the next week, just go and download this darn thing. It's free. I took the time to literally build it for you. Mediterranean chicken wrap. Um, honey mustard glazed salmon. Beef and veggie skewers. Mwah. Sweet potato and spinach turkey casserole. Are you kidding me? And then, of course, the Dolce Diet Power Pasta with ground meat you can eat like this and get i would say look like me i don't know if you'll be as handsome as me i mean come on now we can only do so much with nutrition here by the way um but take a look at these food your family can eat this your kids are going to love it your your spouse is going to love it it's easy to make this is all inspired from my mma fight camps where my athletes needed to ripped they needed to be ripped they needed to have energy they needed to train four to six hours a day six days a week they needed to endure grueling eight and 12 week training camps while getting leaner and lighter the entire time, but getting stronger and more durable and having energy to push. And also, usually many of the athletes, they had a significant other and many had kids. And it wasn't fair to their spouse, typically, who was doing all the cooking that they had to make fighter parent 
one set of meals and then their themselves and their kids another set of meals. So we were able to blend all of the Dolce diet principles of nutrition and dietetics with the socio-cultural emotional impact of delicious meals. That's what I'm doing here. So please download that. Ask me any questions. Leave comments below this video, my friend. Leave comments below this video. Engage with this video. Let me know you're here. This video is for you. Also, I'm going to leave another link below this video to get on our mailing list. We join 35,000 other members of the Dolce Diet mailing list. It is constantly growing. Free recipes, free workout tips, free life hacks. I just, all the members of my mailing list, I just sent them a free 25% discount, which seems like a lifetime discount to Thorne Research Supplements. We brokered a deal with Thorne Research. And as a result of you have a 25% discount on all Thorne Research Supplements, the same health supplements I take and my family takes inside the newsletter, right? So get inside the newsletter, boom, you get access to that. That's less expensive than you can get on Amazon, like crazy stuff. We're always putting free content, free tips, free hacks, free recipes, free workouts, free motivation. It is like, it's, it's awesome. So I don't, I'm, I'm overselling it right now, but it's all free stuff for you guys. I'm so damn passionate. I want to help you guys. And that's what we do here. So check out the link and also let me know, am I right? But before you go, am I right? Am I right? Do you basically eat, eat the same two breakfasts, same two lunches, and same three dinners? Because we did a pretty large research study a few years ago, and that's exactly what we found. And it was un, it, it, it was open-ended. We said, what are your most favorite breakfasts? Which do you eat most often? So we asked a bunch of different questions to get them to answer us honestly. And then we painstakingly went through and we're like, same two, same two, same two, same two. Holy cow, this is pretty crazy. Most people eat the same two darn breakfast, same two darn lunches, same three darn dinners. Is that true of you? Let me know. Let me know in the comments below. I think that's it. I appreciate you guys for being here. You're awesome. If you don't subscribe, hey, subscribe to the channel. Why not? Give this video a thumbs up. Leave comments below so I know you are there. And I will be back again soon. Until next time. Boom.